what's up, my comic community? My name's Cohen, and I collect comics, and today's Wednesday. Normally on Wednesday we do, uh, you know, uh, whatnot if I have that or something like that, but uh, we're actually going to do Comic Sense this Wednesday. But, speaking of whatnot, this week uh, my buddy Johnny was doing a show, and I decided to uh, hang out with him while he did a whatnot show, and... Uh, while he was doing that, he had got me a mystery box, and one of my f watchers from this show actually was in the stream and had them send me some books. So uh, hopefully when that comes in, I'll uh, show those on it. But yeah, shout out to Johnny Dew and Love for Comics. Uh, but uh, yeah, I'm gonna get off. Or I'm gonna get right into this though. We got Comic Sense. Comic Sense is an awesome, awesome, awesome Facebook. Uh, show their Facebook group. They have like a really good uh, group of just looking out and hanging with comic books. They also have a comic shop now and they have a show every week called All the Spec. And it is uh, great. It's every Tuesday at like 5.30 Central Time. 6.30 Eastern Time. And yeah, they have lots of cool books and lots of good stuff that comes out. Mostly, it's the new stuff of the that's coming out that week, and it is always at least 25% off cover. Usually a lot more, but we're gonna get right into it and see what we what I got from Comic Sense two weeks ago. I believe is what this one's going to be. one. I'd rather just cut this all up and one brick at a time, get it out of the way. Oh, but uh, yeah, I really enjoy their, uh, I really, really, really enjoy their show. It's like one of my most favorite things in the world to watch every week. I mean, the guys are cool. They know their stuff pretty much. I mean, they know a lot of stuff. They know a lot of stuff about comics. Sometimes on pop culture, I catch them slipping, but I mean, that's all of us. You know, it's not a pop culture show, it's a comic show. But yeah, they're awesome. Like, legitimately, one of my favorite shows uh, to watch. Uh, Ish is amazing. Ian's awesome. Uh, freaking Rich. And uh, also, Trobes, who's rarely there, but he's always doing something with comics. He's awesome. But yeah, we're going to get right into it though. And I guess we're going to start with this third stack of books. It's like there's a lot of Marvel in this. A ton of Marvel. It's so funny how much Marvel I get because I've gotten so much DC most of my life. And now I'm catching up by getting into a lot of Marvel too. But all right. First, I knew they'd be back. They'd be backwards. So we've got Green Lantern 14, and I actually think I accidentally picked this up already. So I've got two of these, so definitely going to have to send one of those back to Andrew. Next we got Hello Darkness, and this is the first printing, I believe. I was really, really, really excited for this book. Or that might be the second printing, actually. I think we just got on the third. Let's see. Yes, this is the second print of Hello Darkness by Boom, which has got an Erica Slaughter story, which is why I picked it up. Next, IDW, we've got the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, The Night Watcher, which, you know, is a, looks like a cool story with Vandal Jelani, Raphael, I believe. I could be wrong. I'm not sure who The Night Watcher is, so I would imagine. Next, we got Department of Truth, number 23. Y'all know I love my Department of Truth. Next, we got the third issue of Falling in Love on the Path to Hell. And then we have Amazing Spider-Man 55. We have the A cover. And this sweet X-Men cover. And then we have another sweet Disney X-Men cover of Amazing Spider-Man. And then we have the A cover once again. 
always pick up Amazing Spider-Man when I get good deals. And also, I really, I really like those Disney covers. I want to have a bunch of them. So, they were buy one, get one. So, I was able to get the Disney's pretty good. All right, now, moving on to Helverine. And this is number four. And this is a really cool variant on that. And then we have the sweet Stegman cover. Next we have Marvel Secret Wars number eight. The facsimile, which I got one of these a couple years ago. Such a cool book, the original. So I loved it, had to get that foil. Next, we got Spider Boy 10, and we have this sweet variant right here. If you're not picking up Spider Boy, there's a lot of cool stuff going on in it. And here's, of course, this Spider Verse cover, which is the A cover. Next, we got the Venom War Spider Man number one. And then. I pretty much got this because, I mean, how could you turn down? It was two for the price of one, and it was Ultraman with the Avengers. I mean, if you like the Avengers and you like Ultraman. Then we got this awesome Inyuk Lee cover with She-Hulk on it of Ultimates number three. Which I can't remember if that's the first appearance of that She-Hulk or not, but it's a really cool cover. Next, we've got the final one, and we've got the regular Ultimates number three cover. We have Spire Society, Enter the Spider Versers, the two A covers. <coughs> We have Venom number 36 with this sweet, sweet homage to Amazing Spider-Man 129. We have Werewolf by Night Red Band number one. Two copies of those. We have a number one of X-Factor. Then finally, X-Men number two, we have this one. And then we have this sweet J. Scott Campbell magic cover. How can you not love that? Super dope. But yeah, that's what I picked up from the comic strip. Or not the comic strip, sorry. Comic Sense, why did I say that? But yeah, I love it. You should definitely check them out. Uh, got pretty good deals on this. I mean, this is still a lot of books, I mean. I get a lot of books each week. I'm s way too many books, but uh, I love it. Uh, I need to actually get to working on uh, doing some organization because, as always, I never have this thing completely organized. But one of these days, one of these days. But I'm going to get off here. I will talk to you all next time. Thanks for watching. Hit like and subscribe. I will see you on the next video. Man. J. Scott Campbell Magic. Love it. But I'll see y'all next time.